swap. And I'm going to remind you, I'm going to generate a breakout room, and I'm going to send you to a breakout room. I'm going to tell you what number to join. So when I make these, I'm going to give you the number to join. Today's goal is for you to read in these reciprocal rooms. So I've slowly but surely been talking about, hey, that's a clarifying question. I just clarified the vocabulary. Slowly but surely talking about, hey, that's a connecting question. Have you ever, has this ever been something that's happened to you? Uh, a prediction question, and then lastly, the summarizing question, and really the summarizing question being, you know, what was the most important part of this chapter? Uh, I'm going to remind you of your job. I think I had you guys write this down in your language arts. I think I had you write it down. Oh, yeah, look, I wrote it down. I remember having you write it down. So it is in your language arts, and so you will know what room to go to. Ailey, uh, Daniel, Jaina, and Frisha, you're going to go to room one. Uh, ben Streisfeld, Ellie, Lila, Stella, and Luna, you're going to go to room two. Ben Sides, Evelyn, Luke, all of us, you know, you're going to go to room three. Now, you kids, in each, in each of those three rooms is somebody who has done reciprocal reading in my class. So those kids can kind of like lead that, you know, or they kind of have a sense of those, of those expectations. Uh, Cora, Jack, Olivia, and Leo are going to room four. Grant, Terry, and Zen are going to room five. And Giacomo, Layla, Sam, and Theta are going to room six. When I send you to your rooms, kids, uh, fourth 